So I have a loaded question for you, Clayton. What do you think about my English and my pronunciation? And be very careful because we live together. <laughs> That's right. Okay. It's horrible. You should give up and feel ashamed. What? <laughs> <laughs> no, your English is amazing. Ever since I met you, it's been just amazing seeing you learn and grow. And you're better at English than me, hands down. Do you remember how bad my English was when we yeah, started dating? Yeah, I do. We didn't speak English. We spoke German when we started dating. That's right. And then you forced me yeah. to learn English. How yeah. dare you? <laughs> well, you have quite a, a skill to learn language. and um, I was very tenacious. You are tenacious. You are also... Um, uh, well, let's say the best way to learn a language is definitely... Um, motivated by love. So I think that helped drive you to learn it very quickly. And do you think it is a problem that I do have a Czech accent? You know, when I speak, people know I'm not from the U.S. Well, your accent isn't really Czech anymore. What is it? It's just... It's Martina's accent? It's, um, let's say, English as a second language accent. It's oh, okay. it's very soft. It's um, you enunciate all your words. You speak clearly. You use proper grammar, which right there it differs from you know native speakers because a lot of people tend to slur words or speak in slang, such as I. <laughs> so yeah, um, it's not like you have a very thick accent like a Frenchman would. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. You passed the test <laughs> and you can keep living in our house. All right. So everybody, thank you so much for listening our third video podcast. If you liked it, please give us a like or recommend our video to your friends and family. And we will see you next time.